The plan of salvation, with its three divisions, is rather like a grand three-act play. Act one is our premortal life. Act two is mortal life. And act three is life after death. In mortality, you are like one who enters the theater just as act two begins. Act one has already taken place. Hear the offer. Tis well you offer it behind her back. The wish would make us an unquiet house. I have a wife who I protest I love. I would What was that? What's so funny? So that she could entreat She's his wife. These be the Christian husband. Don't you get it? Where's the big guy? Look, this is a complicated play. There are a lot of plots and subplots. And since you missed the first act, it's going to be really hard for you to see how everything fits together. But why don't you just watch the show? But what? And let me do the same? The experience is further complicated by the fact that you are not really just a spectator. You are a member of the cast, on stage, in the middle of it all. The loathing I bear, Antonio, that I follow thus, a losing suit against him. Are you answered? Are you answered? This is no answer. This is no answer. I am not bound to please thee with my answers. Why dost thou wet thy knife so earnestly? To cut the forfeiture from that bank out there. Uh, not on thy soul, but from thy soul, harsh man. What's with him? Him? What's with you? That's the villain. Stand here for law. Now, who's that? He's the hero. Hey, you two. What is going on? This guy doesn't remember anything from Act One. He doesn't know who the villains are, or who the heroes you are. You know the law. You would better get a hold of the script. No! Hey, shouldn't we do something? No, this has to happen. Some things that happen in mortality, act two, will seem unfair or won't make sense. But if we understand act three, life after death, we will know that even these things can help bring God's purposes to pass. Remember that the line, and they all lived happily ever after, doesn't come in act two. That line belongs in the third act when the mysteries are solved and everything is put right. The moon shines bright on such a night as this, the sweet wind it gently... You don't seem to know your part very well. Better take this copy of the script and study it so you won't make any more mistakes. Seeing a soul with many vows of faith and ne'er There exists something of a script for this great play, the drama of the ages. It outlines, in brief form at least, what happened in Act One, the premortal life. While there's not much detail, it makes clear the purpose of it all, and it reveals enough of the plot to help you figure out what life is all about. The script you should already know is the scriptures, the revelations. Read them, study them. The scriptures speak the truth. From them, you can learn enough about all three acts to get your bearings and get direction in life. They reveal that you were also in the beginning with the Father. That is spirit, even the spirit of truth. And the truth is a knowledge of things as they are, as they were, and as they are to come. Act one, act two, and act three.